you guys welcome back to super just tv today's video is a pretty exciting one i think a lot of you guys have been waiting but if this is the first time you're here welcome my name is jessica this is a homeschool slash k-12 slash motherhood lifestyle um, channel i say k-12 because i do make a lot of k-12 content i feel like it's a new thing a lot of people are trying out and i'm just trying to be as helpful as possible and get a lot of content out to answer your questions and help you guys have an easier transition um, as you guys know things are kind of crazy right now and a lot of people are doing school at home so we are doing california virtual academies with um, the k-12 curriculum and um yeah I'm doing art right now too. yeah so today is monday lily is currently doing um she's doing her art lesson right now and it's all about how artists use lines so she, she's going to be using lines in her drawing and she's painting it so she's over here sitting quietly we do have a homeschool room but because this is messy i'm in the kitchen table and she can get paint all over and i'm not going to get upset <laughs> So make sure you guys subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you guys know when I upload new videos. I do upload pretty frequently and a lot of these videos are requests. So yeah, um, let me go ahead and show you guys what I have going on in the screen. So I'm currently logged in. This is her um, OLS student account. We're doing the art lesson 1.3 and it says how artists use lines. And as you can tell, this is basically all the material she needs. It's guiding me here so I know exactly how to go about the lesson. Uh, but yeah, you guys, this is kind of briefly what I'm gonna get into in this video. I do wanna share how I do a math lesson because I think that one is a little bit more interactive and we're going from the screen to the book and um, you guys will see a screen recording as well to kind of help you guys see a little bit better. But yeah, today is Monday, you guys. Um, we're starting off the week. It looks like things are speeding up a little bit. If you guys saw Monday's video, which was, um, it's the K-12 school updates video. I was talking about us not having any class connect sessions. And guess what? We this had, week. We had two. Yes. And I'm so happy because I finally know how to do my, you know, like. You got to talk to your teacher. Yes. And like I know, now I know how to use the chat box. Oh yeah, and she was teaching us how to use more of the stuff on the screen. So yeah, you guys, this week we have a full week of Class Connect sessions. So Lily's gonna be logging in this whole week, I think Monday through Thursday, and then Friday they have, a, and this Friday they have a virtual field trip. So that should be exciting. Um, I think they're going to like an egg farm or something like that. So Wait, yeah. Are we actually gonna go, go? It's a virtual, so you're gonna do it all online. But anyways, you guys, when we get into the math lesson, I will go ahead and get back on here and show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. And like I said, we're gonna have screen recordings and all of that. So for now, I'm gonna let Lily finish up her art lesson and then we're gonna keep going. I just wanted to show you guys Lily's artwork. She's doing really great. Um, Lily, which lines did you use for your painting today? I use straight lines. Uh-huh. I use curls. Which one? This one or this one? Or this one? I kind of did a little wavy on here for no reason, but I'm These are wavy, uh-huh. I didn't mean to do that, but I guess. <laughs> even though these look like clouds. Yeah, like Lily clouds. loves to paint. That looks awesome, baby. Hey guys, so we took a pretty long break. We're back in the homeschool room. We're about to get started on our math lesson, and I'm gonna show you exactly what I do when I'm getting ready um, to get this lesson done. I usually have my books out um, and ready, and I also have a tab so I know exactly what page I left off on. That just gives me, you know, that just helps me save a bit of time. And yeah, so you guys are gonna get to see exactly what I'm doing through the screen. Um, and I'm also gonna open up the page and kind of um, read that quickly because I know um, it just kind of lets me know exactly what we're gonna be working on. Um, so let me show you guys the book first. So this is what we're currently working on right now. My my little uh, bookmark was right here. Um, and we're gonna be doing count by tens and fives through 100. Um, so as you guys can see here, it's basically breaking off this uh, lesson in minutes and you get to see exactly how much work they're gonna do online and how much work they're gonna be doing offline. Um, so this whole um, 
this whole lesson should take us about 10, 30, 40, 50, 60, about an hour. Um, and usually, you know, it really depends on how well your kid is getting the lesson. Sometimes you can work a little bit faster. Sometimes you might take a little bit longer than what they're saying. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and log us in. You guys are gonna get to see exactly what we're doing in this lesson. And I'm just gonna show you the things that I look at first and um, how we kind of go through the lesson together. So when I click on the lesson, this is basically the starting message. It says, in this lesson, students will learn to skip count by fives and tens through 100. Students will use a 100 chart and a number line to help them skip count. So um, advanced prep. So I always click on here to see um, if I'm gonna need anything. This lesson begins with a video from the Learning Coach Strategies series. After watching the video, mark the activity complete if you've already viewed the video in another course. Um, so I'm gonna skip that. And then typically they'll have like a um, kind of like a little review and uh, these are usually about three questions uh, that are going to kind of go into different things that the student has learned before. And they'll kind of have a little activity. So I think we're going to get into this now. It says get ready. And if you guys go back to the book, it also says get ready. So this is a little five minute online activity. And then Lily will go ahead and start that. So usually they'll have a few things that you should read and kind of ask your student. Um, it's kind of getting their mind ready and warmed up to what they're going to be learning. So which is a faster way to count to 100? Counting by ones or skip counting? And then sometimes they'll have like little videos and things like that. And if you can see on top, it says learn. So this is the second activity. Again, it's online and Lily is gonna be learning how to skip count by fives and tens on a number line. Okay, so the next activity again is learn on top. You'll, you'll be able to guide yourself with that. And then on the book, it says learn. Um, find the missing number. And you can guide yourself again. It On the screen, it says missing numbers. So once you're done with that, when you hit next, you'll see the next screen that says try it. Again, it's going right with the book. It says try it, skip count by fives and tens. And this is a 10 minute offline activity. If you look on the screen, it says math plus green activity book and it tells you which page you should be doing. Um, so it's page 13 through 14. So this is the offline activity for today. And if you guys look at the book, all of this was also in the pages so you'll see all the online activities are also in the book it's very helpful to have this on here as well so in case you are stuck on anything it kind of tells you what to do you also get the parent tips on the side um and we are here now so it has a picture of the page you should be doing so if you're ever confused you can just look at them and they should match and then you also get the um answers so um we're going to go on to the next activity, which is a quiz, and it says quiz on top, and um, in the book, it's called a checkpoint. Um, again, you're going to have the answers on here, and then um, you're going to need your password to start this. Okay, you guys, so that is basically how we do math, and um, this is one of our favorite subjects, and I love um, this book is very detailed and I really like how they have every step um, and you get to see exactly what they should be working on whether it's online or offline and they also have the tips in there for you um, we're usually able to work this through this really fast unless Lily is stuck on something um, but so far it's been a very smooth um, lesson and we never really have issues with anything my teacher has um, advised us to do everything we see online so sometimes these books will be a little bit behind or maybe something is different and it's not matching what you see online so our teacher has told us before to just go with what you see online which makes sense because these are the answers that we're sending directly to them but yeah if you guys have any questions let us know we are doing california virtual academies and we're doing the k-12 curriculum um i think it might be a little bit different depending on where you're at this is how our lesson guide looks and my daughter lily um if you guys didn't know she's a first grader so and i got a cat yeah 
But anyways, you guys, one thing that I wanted to mention quickly in this video, because I know a lot of our students are doing a lot of online work, as you guys saw, this particular lesson does have a lot of online work. Um, Lily has these blue light glasses that I've mentioned before. Um, I don't know if you guys know about blue light glasses. My glasses are also blue light protection. And because we're working online a lot, this is just to protect our eyes from the harsh blue light from the screen so if you guys are interested to check these out i'll go ahead and attach a link down in my description below and i guess that's it if you guys would want to see like a part two or a different lesson just let me know leave a comment down below and if you guys found this video helpful don't forget to smash that like button here put these on so they can see how cute you look <laughs> And don't forget, I got a cat. Come here. Whee! Okay, we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye. And don't forget to watch Little Coin TV. Bye. Bye. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Whee!